Hey developers and admins, Jack Wallen here to help you make tech work. If you have to secure a shell into multiple machines throughout the day, you might want to take advantage of Easy SSH. Let's find out how it works. Open the app from your desktop menu and click the plus button in the top left corner. In the resulting window, fill out the information for the remote machine, including name, group, host, port, username, and password. If you use SSH key authentication for your connections, make sure to click the checkbox for Change Password to Identity File. That text field will change to a dropdown. Click the dropdown and then navigate to your SSH key identity file. By default, that file will be in your .ssh folder in your home directory and will be named ID underscore RSA dot pub. Once you have your connection configured, click Save. With your connection created, all you have to do is double-click its entry in the left pane to open the Easy SSH terminal window. If you configured the username and password, the connection will be made automatically. If you configured it with an identity file, you'll be prompted to type the SSH key password. If you want to see more how-to videos, subscribe to our How to Make Tech Work YouTube channel. Also, check out Tech Republic for the latest news in tech.